I'm going to take out the story. Wow. The live potato is a forever promise. The new heaven and the new earth. Tom was a disciple of Jesus. One, one day, Jesus came to him in a vision, shining like the sun. Don't be afraid, said Jesus. I die, now I live forever. So John was one disciple, and Jesus was appeared to him and said, I have died and now I am live forever. So he said, Don't be afraid of like that. The John saw the new heaven and the earth. God's promise, new creation, the first heaven and the first earth were gone and the sea was done. So God has, uh, Jesus has shown him in a vision the new heaven and the earth. Question. How did Jesus appear to John? Number one, in a vision. Number two, a mountain. Number three, a coconut tree. Number one is the correct answer. Hmm. Next, John saw God's holy city, the new Jerusalem, it was coming down from heaven. It was beautiful like a bird on her wedding day, ready to meet her husband. So, John has saw the God's holy city in the new Jerusalem. It was coming down from heaven. Okay. And the, it was very beautifully made it and it was shiny and just like one it was like the wedding place. John heard the loud voice coming from the throne of God saying, From now on, God will make his home among his people and they will be all live together. And his, in his new work, there is such a beautiful river and a beautiful home. And boys and girls will live together. In this new heaven and the earth, there is there won't be any tears because no one will be pain and no one will die. Those things were gone forever. 
so in this new heaven and the earth, there will be no fears because there is no pain there and they will, no one will die there. They will just live forever. <laughs> but actually, there is also bad place who don't like do bad things in this earth who do bad things and don't believe Jesus and do whatever they want they will go to that bad place and there is fires and lots of bad things there the voice from the strong said I am the beginning and the earth and if you are thirsty come to me and I will give you the water of life. So <clears throat> this earth is beginning and the end. If you're thirsty, come to me. I will give you the life of water. Will there be pain and death in the new earth and heaven and the new earth? No, there will be no pain, there will be no fear, they will don't, they will not die. My new word is for my children do who's, who were faithful to me. I am making all things new. It's true, you can count on it. So my new earth, my new word is for my children who believe me and do good things. I'm making this all true. You can see it, you can count on it. <laughs> All good. Question. The new word will be for those who believe in Jesus and are faithful to him. True. Yes, today every time I was sorry, a forever promise. The new heaven and the earth. Tomorrow, next time, I will read good, God's good news. Be part of the stories. That means what we have learned until now. We will. We will see. Like revising, okay? Yeah. And uh, for many days I didn't do love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. And like a David, watching his shrimp. Fight with bees, annoyed. Actually, I cannot. I, I know to be king. David plays for King Saul, defeats his enemies. Fail from King Saul, crowned as a king. Son Solomon is born. David writes songs to God. I'm an after guard. Hand of salvation. Shield of faith, belt of truth, good new shoes, sword of the spirit, chest armor of living right. 
I only have to do this one. Temple treasures. Altered off. Give to God the holy chest. Wash it, pull the holy room skirt. And another. I will make it late at the last day. And I will learn. Yes, today I wrote the little story. Did you enjoy? Then bye!